I would like to show you some future possibilities of our energy management system, the CEMS 9060. As you can see here, we have a universal holding cabinet. This is currently being used by McDonald's. This kitchen equipment has the lettering Smart Enabled. And what that means is that this kitchen equipment can communicate via a built-in interface. This special feature is a data exchange over the electrical power line to the equipment. A data line to the equipment is therefore not required. McDonald's uses this technology, LAN over power line. Actually a very clever idea and in our opinion also one of the best ways to communicate with the kitchen equipment. And as you can see here from Mungerberger developed energy management system and for this system Mungerberger has a special LAN over power line send and receive plugin. This plugin uses exactly the same technology as the McDonald's equipment and is capable to communicate with such devices. Here are the workflow. First we plug in the LAN gateway into the designated LAN slot. The gateway logs onto the system and already we can for example from the external database or from our system analyze or remotely control the device. Now look at this demonstration. As you can see, we can start up the equipment, read and change the menu, settings and temperatures. And we are also able to analyze and document temperatures for the HACCP dashboards. We have the possibility to switch equipment devices in standby if the device is not being used. And this, of course, when the equipment allows us to do this. For example, HACCP documentations, device settings, operation and fault messages can in the future on the fly be analyzed and controlled. Mungelberger has incidentally developed a HACCP module for cooler and freezers. These modules work exactly on the same principles. Again, the data is transmitted by LAN over power line. Let me show you how it works. We have a module and a temperature probe. The temperature probe is installed inside the cooling device, which could be a refrigerator or a wall freezer. This is only an example. You simply mount the HAZIP sensor inside the device. Then you plug in the LAN module into the outlet socket. Now all you have to do is plug in the sensor into the LAN module and already the data is being transferred to our control unit. When we install a sensor in a refrigeration unit, it measures the air temperature inside that unit. Some of our clients want, however, a value in the core temperature. For this, Mungelberger has developed a so-called HACCP bubble. These bubbles are, for example, salads, hamburger patties, fish, meat, and dairy products. The installation is simple. Simply take the appropriate bubble and put it on the HACCP sensor. Due to the special design of the sensor, 2-in-1, not only the air temperature but also the core temperature will be simulated and transferred. Unnecessary alarms, for example, defrost periods, are avoided. A specially designed bracket allows several different bubbles to be installed in refrigeration units. I hope you have enjoyed this demonstration.